Welcome back everyone, we are playing Freedom Planet once again as Lilac the Dragon. Lilac being the fast one of the bunch. And so, we are at Pangu Lagoon right now. This is a stage that only she has access to, and the reason that she has access to it the other than lore is the fact that this is very much designed with her in mind. So we're going to be seeing special things that only she can do in this stage. First I'm going to be getting a whole bunch of gems, because I love gems. And a card. Um, I had pop and I didn't realize it. Spin, spin, spin. Oh. Pinwheels. Pinwheels don't do anything, they just look nice. Oop. Oh, here we go. This is what I'm talking about. Bam! This allows you to actually dash twice. So we will be making good use of that. It's going to appear throughout the stage. Electric shield, so now we get more gems! We're gonna bounce around a bit. It's been a pretty difficult so far, we haven't really ran into too much, we're just sort of learning maybe about the gimmick of the stage. We're also noticing these bees. The bees will be in much the other presence than flower shield. Okay, oh, card, card. Got it. Yeah, the breath shield is not going to be too useful here. I don't even think there is any water, actually. Oh, doesn't be useful now. Bam! Here. Oh, oh gosh. These guys are no joke. They will wreck your stuff. Okay, I want to lure them away from that platform, so... Got it. Much safer to do it this way. Yep. This is actually one of the higher levels in the game. For most of the Lord, like it's a free pass, and in fact that she's just so much faster than other characters and she can dodge stuff really easily. But in this stage, you'll notice that there's actually tons and tons of danger, so even Lord, like has to worry about it. Now these bees, however, they are no danger. They just have so many abilities to help you deal with them that they just, they're a nuisance, but otherwise, they will not bother you. Good news, you should never die to them. Oh. No thanks, no poison for me. Oh, I wanted up there. I can still get up there, I think. Gems! not much up here. Oh. You're in an infinite loop. That's weird. Actually, I think these... Yeah, these are ladders. I keep forgetting. Oh. Checkpoint. Oh. Flower shield. Don't want that. Oh. I want the fire shield. Fire shield deals damage. Japanese letters. I... I guess the old dragons were Japanese too. Yeah, pretty much everything in this game is based on sort of a Japanese aesthetic. Not sure what the design decision was that led to that, but yeah, that is the case. Give me that. Oh. Jim! It's a laser, everyone. That's what it does. Come on. Okay. I think actually, it's supposed to go back here. Okay. The 
those things, we haven't really seen Mia in action yet, but those things have shields and blocks that look just like the ones that Mia can conquer. Can conquer. So, the club thickens. And Mia is definitely very weird, and she has powers that nobody else does, and it's not really explained, like, even if you play all the way through this game. So, all I can really hope for is that this will be explained in a sequel, or it should be expansion stuff that's going to be released later. I don't know. Well, I do know that fire shield, I love fire shields. Oh, bees! Bees! Of course, like I said, we have ways to deal with them. This platform simply makes me bee proof. I wish I was bee proof in real life. That'd be cool. These generally will not mess with you, I've noticed, but, um, I don't know. I don't like them anyways. Oh no. Oh wait, that's right. No bottomless pits in this game, that is a science fiction they did not like, so they decided... Yeah, you'll get a punishment, but the punishment will not be death. So if you slip and slide, nothing in the world. It just means you gotta deal with more bees, which nobody likes. They just made for lilac, you have to make something just easier. Tons and tons of shells, they don't give you health in this stage, they just give you shells pretty much. Oh. Nope, not today. Okay. Oh yeah, flowers grow back. That would have been important to mention. It can be really annoying. There's going to be certain parts in later stages where the flowers are just going to be a supreme nuisance. Oh, just got to leave. The flowers are going to be a supreme nuisance. Not yet, though. They're just a minor nuisance. One can make this with many things that cannot kill you on their own, but nonetheless, they do get damage to you. Well. That's how you lose the shield really quickly. Nope, gotta wait. And go! Sweet! Okay, okay. Some of the things that's gonna be changing this let's play is I've been taking a little bit of feedback from like the two subscribers I have and one thing that's going to be happening is that I'm going to be recording these in smaller sessions until I feel like I really have a handle on things. These guys are not giving me the time of day. I feel like I uh, really have a long way to go uh, in terms of becoming an entertainer, so until I really reach that point, I'm just going to be recording more often and trying to really watch myself and improve as I go along. At least that's the theory. The other thing I'm going to be doing is I'm actually going to be announcing when episode is ending so it's not so abrupt. I'm going to do this. Not easy, but I got it. Oh man. Pretty dangerous stage, but not nearly as dangerous as the boss, let me tell ya. This boss killed me so many times. This... this can't be possible! Oh, it's possible. So speaking of that, since I know this is going to take me a long time, I think I'm going to end this episode right here, so I will see you soon.